Is China already living in the year 2050? Here, self-driving cars take you to work, drones deliver your food right to your door, and robots care for patients, sell goods, or even clean your home. Technology has stepped out of the laboratory and become part of everyday life. From factories to pedestrian streets, from hospitals to museums, robots and AI are no longer just for display. They are working, guiding, and living alongside humans. While many other nations remain entangled in wars and conflicts, China has chosen a different path, investing in technology, innovation, and its own future. Today, we will explore the inventions and AI systems that are turning China into a true preview of the future. I am James, your host, and welcome to China Discoveries Official. Home Service Humanoid Robots the concept of a housekeeper is being completely redefined in China. The new generation of humanoid service robots such as Xiaomi Cyber One, Fourier GR1, and UBTech Walker Mini stand about 5 feet 3 inches tall, weigh around 100 pounds, and are equipped with 32 core AI processors, 12 depth cameras, 8 directional microphones, and a full 360 degree sensor array that allows them to see, hear, understand, and respond like real humans. They can recognize 200 faces, analyze speech by emotional tone, remember the daily habits of each family member, and adjust their actions accordingly, brewing coffee in the morning, teaching English to children in the evening, or clearing the dinner table. Their six degree of freedom robotic arms, accurate to within one millimeter, allow them to clean, cook, and fold clothes without dropping or spilling anything. Each robot connects seamlessly to the home's AI network, controlling lighting, air conditioning, security, and even smart pets. Priced from about $15,000, nearly 70% cheaper than comparable American models, China is moving closer to a future where every household has its own AI assistant, where technology not only supports life, but becomes an integral part of it. Flying Electric Vehicle by Guangzhou Automobile Group. Guangzhou Automobile Group is leading the urban air mobility revolution with its EV Tall, the first fully China-developed hybrid between a car and a helicopter. The vehicle features eight electric rotors, a two-seat cockpit, and can take off or land vertically within five seconds, even in densely populated areas. The EV Tall is equipped with AI-based autonomous navigation, 4D LiDAR radar sensors, and a multi-point collision avoidance system. The passenger simply inputs the destination, and the aircraft automatically calculates the safest altitude, route, and speed. It cruises between 80 and 120 miles per hour, and can fly more than 180 miles per charge. Its 150 kilowatt hour lithium silicon battery can recharge up to 80% in just 25 minutes. Initial flight tests in Guangzhou in 2024 were successful and certified for safety by the Civil Aviation Administration of China. GAC plans to commercialize the EV Tall by 2030, with thousands of flying cars expected to operate in Shenzhen, Guangzhou, and Beijing. While much of the world is still testing flying vehicles in controlled zones, China has already taken its EV tolls into real skies turning the long-held dream of the flying car into a new transportation layer where traffic jams become a thing of the past. China drone firefighter in Shanghai and Beijing. AI-controlled firefighting drone systems are now being deployed in real operations, making China the first country to use autonomous robotic air fleets for urban fire response. Each drone weighs about 77 pounds, carries between five and six and a half gallons of high-pressure extinguishing fluid, can fly continuously for 30 to 35 minutes in 400 degrees Celsius conditions and reach altitudes of nearly 1,000 feet to access high-rise fires. Equipped with dual infrared cameras, 3D LiDAR radar, and AI navigation accurate to within half a meter, each drone can spray water or foam precisely over one square meter zones, penetrating thick smoke and automatically adjusting pressure according to the fire's temperature. 
A centralized coordination system allows up to 16 drones to fly in formation, working together like an airborne swarm to suppress flames in perfect synchronization. During 2024 trials in Shanghai, just three minutes after a fire alarm was triggered, the drone team extinguished a blaze on the 26th floor before human firefighters arrived. Beyond firefighting, these drones can perform rescue lifts, spray cooling water, and provide emergency lighting during power outages. While many countries are still experimenting with small-scale firefighting drones, China has already launched a full-scale robotic response force, a leap that transforms urban firefighting into seamless collaboration between humans, AI, and the sky itself. Smart Parking Robots In crowded cities like Beijing, Shenzhen, and Hangzhou, autonomous parking robots are replacing humans in managing parking lots. Developed by Chinese companies such as Yifeng Automation and Forward X Robotics, the system has already been deployed in more than 40 smart parking facilities across the country. Each robot is only about six inches thick, seven feet long, and weighs around 1,100 pounds. It slides beneath a car, lifts vehicles weighing up to five and a half thousand pounds, and moves them with pinpoint accuracy within less than an inch of deviation. The entire parking process takes just two to two and a half minutes, four times faster than traditional parking, increasing total capacity by 40% without expanding physical space. The AI control system combines 360-degree LiDAR laser sensors, ultrasonic cameras, and real-time mapping to allow the robots to operate around the clock while completely avoiding collisions. Drivers simply scan a QR code and the robot automatically retrieves or parks the car via the shortest route. Unlike in the United States or Europe, where such technology remains in the testing phase, China has already fully commercialized automated parking systems transforming cramped underground garages into intelligent vehicle storage networks where AI and mechanical robots operate more smoothly than humans ever could. Humanoid Robots Unitree G1 Nicknamed the most flexible humanoid robot in the world, the G1 stands 4 feet 3 inches tall, weighs 77 pounds and features 23 ultra-precise joints. Each joint delivers up to 40 newton meters of torque and reacts at 1,000 hertz, allowing the robot to walk, twist, jump, and balance like a professional athlete. Equipped with a 32-core AI processor, three-dimensional vision cameras, and 12 pressure sensors, the G1 can run at three miles per hour, carry loads of up to 11 pounds, open bottle caps, and perform 25 different martial arts movements. Every motion is modeled on real human movement through motion imitation learning, making the robot's actions smooth, natural, and precise down to the millimeter. With a price of only $16,000, about 30 times cheaper than Boston Dynamics Atlas, the G1 is currently the most advanced and affordable humanoid robot on the market. At the same time, the X Robots line is redefining the concept of human-like machines. Each unit features soft silicone skin that mimics a temperature of 97.7 degrees Fahrenheit, 140 facial expressions, independently moving eyes with a 120 degree range, and a conversational AI capable of remembering emotions. Some models even replicate the appearance and voice of historical figures, such as Einstein and Hawking, serving in museums, hotels, and technology exhibitions in Beijing and Shanghai. Maglev Trains, the world's fastest floating trains. China's new generation of superconducting maglev trains has reached an incredible speed of 404 miles per hour in just seven seconds of acceleration. In laboratory tests, it has even touched 620 miles per hour, five times faster than America's current high-speed trains, which average around 125 miles per hour. This is now the fastest commercial train on Earth, marking the beginning of a new era of transportation that breaks the limits of mechanical motion. The maglev train has no wheels and never touches the track. It floats using powerful superconducting magnetic fields that eliminate friction completely, allowing it to glide silently with no vibration or noise. Its acceleration rate of 1.5 meters per second squared is equivalent to an airplane taking off, 
yet passengers can stand comfortably thanks to an automatic balance system. On the Beijing-Shanghai line, which stretches about 745 miles, travel time has been cut from five and a half hours to just two and a half hours, a record that forces the world to redefine what high speed really means. What makes this achievement even more remarkable is that every part of the technology, from the magnetic rail system to the AI-based levitation control, was developed entirely within China, proving the country's position as a global leader in ultra-high-speed transportation innovation. Self-driving taxis and smart roads today, 19 cities across China, from Beijing and Shenzhen to Wuhan, already have more than 16,000 self-driving taxis operating daily. These vehicles travel along over 20,000 miles of intelligent roads designed specifically for autonomous driving. Each road is equipped with thousands of radar sensors, AI cameras, and V2X communication devices that allow cars to detect traffic signals, pedestrians, and obstacles in less than one-tenth of a second. Passengers simply open an app, choose their destination, and a Baidu Apollo RT6 self-driving taxi automatically arrives. The car unlocks using facial recognition, greets the passenger with an AI-generated voice, and drives smoothly with an accuracy rate of 99.9%. Each vehicle can operate for 20 hours per day. Transmitting more than 100 terabytes of data to a central control hub for real-time route optimization. China is now the largest real-world operator of autonomous transportation in the world. Surveys show that 85% of Chinese citizens are willing to use self-driving vehicles, compared to only 39% in the United States, highlighting the nation's confidence in its own technology. While much of the world is still running limited pilot programs, China has already entered full commercial operation, laying the foundation for the largest driverless transportation network on the planet. BYD Yangwang U8. The BYD Yangwang U8 is an electric SUV priced at only $150,000, yet it carries technology far beyond any commercial standard. It can rotate 360 degrees on the spot like a tank, move sideways like a crab, and even float on water up to five feet deep for 30 minutes, traveling at nearly two miles per hour without the need for any auxiliary engine. In flooding situations, the U8 can transform into an emergency rescue vehicle, proving how advanced technology can serve real-life needs. More than just a luxury car, the U8 has become a symbol of practical innovation. Over 10,000 units have already been sold within just a few months in China. Meanwhile, the IM Motors L6 features independently rotating wheels that allow it to park sideways in spaces 11% narrower than conventional cars, with a turning radius of just 16.4 feet. BYD's Z9 GT model also turns heads with its unique sideways sliding function, ideal for maneuvering in tight urban areas. Together, these vehicles show how China is turning high technology into everyday utility, where electric cars do not just drive, they spin, slide, and float, setting a new global standard for smart mobility in the modern age. EV Tiol electric flying taxi. If in the United States, air taxi projects like Joby and Archer are still running limited test flights, then in China, EV tolls have already been officially licensed for real operation. Leading the charge are the Ehang AAV and the Xpeng Aero HT. Two flying cars capable of taking off vertically like helicopters and gliding smoothly through the air at speeds between 80 and 185 miles per hour completely autonomous. Passengers simply select their destination on the touchscreen, and the onboard AI calculates the safest route, altitude, speed, and landing point. Test flights have already taken place in the heart of Guangzhou and Shenzhen, and the Civil Aviation Administration of China has granted the world's first commercial flight certification for the Ehang Air Taxi. Beyond urban transport, these EV tolls are also designed for emergency rescue, sightseeing, and medical logistics in congested areas. The Chinese government aims to have 10,000 air taxis in operation in Shenzhen by the year 2030, turning the sky into the city's third transportation layer. China is not just creating advanced technology, it is making it part of everyday life for millions. From self-driving cars to intelligent robots and automated farming, 
Everything shows how the country is already living in the future today. Which technology impresses you the most? Let us know in the comments below. And do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to China Discovery's official to explore more amazing stories about the technologies shaping our world. I am James. See you in the next journey of discovery.